Hello, and welcome back to Think Tank. I'm Pastor Devin. Thank you so much for joining us. And, uh, you know, in Christianity, sometimes we have <clears throat> an issue with, with when we look at other Christians. We go, well, I, I wish I was like then. Or sometimes we, we, we kind of think of us more highly than we ought to think sometimes. You know, that's just part of the human condition. We see that in the world all the time, where everybody is in the chain of command or who, who has more authority and this and that. You know what the great thing about Jesus is? There's only two ranks in Jesus' in Jesus's army. Uh, he's the general, and then we're his children. We're his family. We, we, we're all the same. God treats us all exactly the same. Galatians 3.28 is a wonderful verse to read. It says there's no difference between anybody. God loves us all the same. He says, and I want to empower you all the same. There is no such thing as someone's better than someone else in the faith of the Lord. Now, there could be... Uh, where you're different in your walk of the Lord. Someone might be here and someone might be here or there. But you know, as far as God's concerned, he loves us all the same. And we're all going to face all kinds of battles. You know, like in any battle, does it? when the enemy comes on, they don't go, oh, well, no, I didn't want to fight you today. I'm going to move on to somebody else. That's, that's not what the enemy does. If you're there, you're there. And God says, I have the ability to give you power to overcome anything because greater is he that is in you than he that is in the world. You know, it says in James 4, 7, Resist, submit to God and resist the devil and he will flee from you. He doesn't say he will flee if you're at a certain level of Christianity. No, God says, I give you all that I have to you because I love you so very much. And we all have equal amount of ability to be great with God. And we don't have to have some all this stuff behind our name or know all this. Stuff. God, we just have to have a relationship with Jesus that's alive, relevant, and vibrant and working in our lives where others see, and God will bless that. God will bless you, and you can do amazing things beyond what you think you can do because Jesus is with you, and he wants to use you. He wants to put his power through you so you can experience that, so you can help others and see how great God is. And why does God do that? Why does God treat us all that way? Because it's real simple for each and every one of you out there that Jesus loves you, I love you, and Jesus thinks that you are absolutely awesome.